chickens, I want you to get your calculators out because this is a calculator section. Read the problem very carefully and try to answer it by yourselves before you unpause the video and get to me. Let's do this. This is the problem. Pause your video. Let's do this together. So whenever they're giving you a chart and they're asking you about the probability, I want you to be very, very careful with the way your chart is designed. You're always going to have your totals at the bottom here and here. Sometimes you're not gonna have them so that you will need to create those totals. But these are the totals of your columns and these are the totals of your rows. Be very, very careful at where you're looking. What I like to do for myself, and I recommend this to my chickens who struggle with this, is instead of trusting the SAT and calculating 414, I just go with the inside. I do all of my own calculations. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm not very trusting. You'll see what I mean by that. So... They say that there was a 607 surgeons that were um, surveyed and um, they asked them about their professional activities. Some of them teach and some of them do research. So, for example, if we wanted to find the number of orthopedic, um, orthopedic, pedic, orthopedic surgeons that do research, that would be 74. The question is, if one was selected at random, one of the surgeons were selected at random. This is the place where you know your total. Your total is the total number of surgeons. And they give it to you in the chart. They say here. So that is your total number of outcomes. Because if they can select any surgeon at random, they're choosing from 607. My probability. And now they say, which of the following is close to the probability that the selected surgeon is an orthopedic surgeon whose indicated professional activity is research? 74. And when you um, divide 74 by 607, you get A. I hope every one of you guys got this. And I really encourage you to be careful when you're looking at your chart. What are your totals? Is this the total of all of the surgeons or only the surgeons that do research? And I'll see you in a next video where we um, go over a hard problem. Bye.